What's up, Yang Gang? <laughs> What's up, Yang Gang? So we are out here at the polls today, and we are about to do what we fought so hard to do. And tonight, I promise you, Yang Gang, we will sleep better knowing that we cast our vote for Andrew Yang. Bo Yang, y'all get out there, practice your democracy if you're in a Super Tuesday state. Go vote. Go vote. I'm not going to tell you who to vote for. I am. Vote for Yang. <laughs> we love you, Yang Gang. Sanitizer. <laughs> All right, so ah, we did it. We did it, Yang Yang. <laughs> we cast our vote yeah. for Andrew Yang. I was going They made Mama strip her shirt off. Yeah, I had to strip. Luckily, I got this undershirt on because I knew that I would not be able to wear that in there, but I tried anyways. <laughs> I had to take it off in there. Ma'am, I'm sorry. Yeah, I have that. You're gonna have to strip right here. I'll... We did it. We can yeah. sleep good tonight. <laughs> we voted for the good of the country. Mm -hmm. Practice your democracy, Yang Gang. Get out and vote. Excuse me, ma'am. Yes. Ma Who are you? I'm with Grassroots Yang Gang. Who's and that? Is that YouTube? on the YouTubes? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, on the YouTubes. You should watch it. You should check it out sometime. It's really awesome. So. You are at your local polling place in Vermont. Who are you voting for today? Andrew Yang. What? I voted for Andrew Yang. Prediction time. On you, what's your prediction? So, my predictions for this Super Tuesday. Super Tuesday. You know, this is a tough one. I think I'm pretty good at predictions, but I actually don't know who will come out ahead. Biden? after all of his recent endorsements, or Bernie, because I do believe it's between those two. Now, I think Bloomberg's gonna get, in some states, maybe get up to 10, 15%. It's a possibility. I don't know if he's actually gonna win in these states, you know? Neither I don't think Warren. he is. And, and they've been talking a lot about, uh, and Bloomberg has also, you know, hinted at the fact uh, that he wants a contested <laughs> convention. Yeah. Because that, that means he would fare better. If it goes to a contested convention, I believe that once again, Bernie Sanders, regardless of what happens, will get screwed out of the nomination. It will most likely be Biden, but none of that will matter unless he chooses Yang as his VP. It's his best shot at winning, and I know that Biden has hinted around at the fact, you know, that Pete Buttigieg reminds him of his son, and this and that. Uh, you just proved what a lifetime politician you are. Your, your son passed away. His son passed away last year, and now all of a sudden, Booty's, Booty just reminds him of, come on, man. That's just pure politics. So, we don't, you know, we don't know. We, vote, of course, voted for Yang today. But we don't know who we're going to be voting for in the general election because we haven't gotten there yet. Like, our mind frame is still, we want Andrew Yang. We're not sure what we're trying to accomplish voting for Yang in the primaries, but... But whatever it is, we accomplish it. Yeah, he deserved our votes. Because he's the only one that, quite frankly, earned my vote. Mm -hmm. You know, I spent so much time, we spent so much time around him. That was the only person that we could vote for. I am so sick and tired of voting for the lesser of two evils. And if it is a Donald Trump and Bernie Sanders shit show, you know? I don't want to vote that way anymore, man. I'm sick and tired of having to vote that way. So anyway... Much lighter note. We love you, Yang Gang. Thank you for practicing democracy with us. Oh, catch Yang on CNN tonight. See you on the next one. Yummy, 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 yummy.